Welcome back. I'll be going over a welcome to FC event guide for you guys so you can go ahead and get some of these welcome to FC players. So let me get straight into it. Right away, you're going to want to go to quest to see what you need to do to get welcome points and star points. Now, star points are for the past. Welcome points are for your events to get your player. So there is welcome to FC mobile daily quest and welcome to mobile weekly quest. So there is your weekly quest and daily daily is the easiest one to do obviously weekly will be something that takes a while to complete it does refresh in seven days because you know weekly you will be able to complete these and then get some new ones to complete again weekly because this lasts for a whole month to complete so it's not gonna be something that you're gonna get straight away but something you will be able to get in the long run now all you have to do throughout your weekly quest is score 10 goals in any mode win one versus attacker head to head match complete five passes in a match acquire one pack from the store complete one skill game or match in events and then you'll get star point welcome point gems players coins and etc and then you'll get the main reward which will give you 12 welcome points and 25 star points and then your weekly quest will give you a lot more but that's just weekly and that's just nice in general. So let me head into the play now so I can go over the live events for the new teams, new challenges, and then the new goals. So the pass and just in general. So we have the welcome points and the star points. Welcome points is where you will go ahead and get this 88 right wing from completing two of the reward paths. Now the reward paths are pretty simple. All you have to do is play throughout the quest that I showed you. And that is basically the everyday ones and the weekly ones. Weekly will obviously come weekly or less than that, depending on, you know, what you do to get them. And then daily is just daily. That's just something you should be doing every day to maintain the path. Now, the rewards are not that great along the path. OK, you get some coins, you get some gems, you get a chance at a 94, which is fantastic. If you do pull it and another chance at 94, obviously you might not pull it. We have the 60 through 69. Uh, I don't even know why that's a thing. Like, who wants that? That's not even something. Yeah. And then this is the last one. The main ones. 80 through 94. You have a chance at 94. Honestly, if you pull 94, that's fantastic. Then the second one, you have your five events again. So, same rewards. Yeah, basically. Yeah, same rewards. And then the last one is at 80 through 93. So, it goes down one overall for the max you can pull. Same for the other two. But all you have to do is complete two of them i mean you can do this first one over here and this last one over here because it's an 80 through 94 if you don't want the 80 through 93 and 8 to 92 because you have to complete two of the paths so you choose any of the four paths you want to complete and then you can get the 88 right wing throughout the remainder of the welcome to fc mobile now basically the welcome points you will get throughout the remainder of this program is for the kickoff, 1,200 welcome points. For the daily quest, 900 welcome points. For the weekly quest, 1,400 welcome points. For the exchange, 1,000 welcome points. And for the new goals pass, 100. Altogether, that is 4,600 welcome points. Now, for the star points, which is the pass, and yeah, it's right here. Basically, you should, from the daily quest, get 3,000 star points. Weekly quest, 1,200 star points. Exchange, around 2,000. And adds, 900. And that's a total of 7,150 star points. Now, star points will help you throughout the program by you claiming welcome points from it. And then, etc. Which is just, what? Honestly, the first thing is the most helpful thing. Everything else doesn't really help you throughout the program. So, I mean, just claim the first one for 200 star points. And then you get... 100 welcome points which is actually really nice and then go back to the new teams and then put it in for the first one which is perfect and yeah i mean it's just a process you're gonna have to play throughout the quest to maintain the events at the end of the day really what is this new challenges oh yeah new challenges is something too now this is basically with the program but honestly, I think new teams and new goals is like the main thing. This is just some confirmed rewards you will get if you just play along with it. Now, the first one you can easily play. I did, I think, the normal one once and then the hard one twice. Because the hard gives you four 
yeah four progress so that's if you do it twice eight and then the top is two all together is ten because you need to complete it ten times now one out of four for the one piece i think i pulled a decent play out there i'll put it on the screen i'm pretty sure i took a screenshot it was actually not that bad and then this next one unlocks in seven days and then 14 days and 21 days and then when you complete that you will get an 85 through 93 so honestly not that bad so you can have a chance to pull a good player from the new challenges and then throughout your progress from just playing you will get an 88 right wing and a chance at an 80 through 94 and another 80 through 94 so just make sure you guys are maintaining stuff and playing throughout the game you can complete all five reward paths each costing 750 welcome points combined with 3000 welcome points honestly all together you will get a bunch of players and the only guaranteed player you're going to get is the 88 right wing all the other ones are chances but that is the full guide to the welcome to fc mobile program so i hope you guys did enjoy and i hope you get some good players and at the end of it get that right wing because that is a solid player to put on the team so there you have it hope you guys did enjoy and i'll catch you in the next one peace